<sighs> That's better. Hello. How's everyone doing? Uh, I know I look kind of groovy. I feel kind of groovy. Yes, that's a pineapple. You feel me? Hair's looking good. I thought about cutting it um, recently, and every time I'm thinking about cutting it, my hair actually starts speaking to me. Um, my hair is actually alive. It's connected to the universe. So it feels, it senses on some Samson shit. There's a Delilah nearby, but it's, it's me playing Delilah, if that makes any fucking sense. Hey there, Delilah. Anyways, so whenever it senses a blade, it's like, no, what the fuck is wrong with you? Don't you want to be connected to the fucking universe? All right, that's enough madness. It is now the 20th day of Alchemist dropping, and it's been madness. Um... First of all, I need, if you're watching this video, to pause this video and say, like, think of prayer or reach out to Jan. He was the performer for Cirque du Soleil. I've been ushering um, during that time and I was there that night when the accident occurred. And a lot of us were going through our mourning process and it's been, it's been a challenge because me personally, I felt everything. It's almost as if, you know how, you know how like you would go through um, grief in the heart there's one thing that you personally would feel, your own emotion. And then there's another thing of feeling everyone else's emotion around you. So it's like your emotion times 20. And it just amplifies. And I'm sensitive energetically. And so it was a lot for me. It was really a lot for me. And though I did not know him, he has impacted my life. That being said, love yourself, stay in your power, follow your heart, and do what you are passionate about. If you are not doing what you're passionate about, then simply dream. That's the first step, dream. And then the next step is to finally realize that, wait a second, these dreams are so vivid to me that I can taste it. So if these dreams are so vivid that I can taste it, why not taste it? In all actuality, if I can close my eyes and I can visualize my reality, the one that I want in my life, and I can feel and all my senses just wrap around it, and I could actually smell how it feels to be in this new environment. Why don't I see it before me when I open my eyes? Doubt. What if I told you you had no eyes? What if I told you your body didn't exist. And you're simply an essence with senses. Then what is the difference between reality and a dream? There is none, it's just a word that we fuck with it. What if I told you that when you go asleep at night, it's something as simple as, you know, you're driving, you're on your way to work, and as you're on your way to work, you decide to take a different exit. 
And so you take a different exit. And when you take that exit, you start to see new things. You start to see new environments. You're like, what? I've never seen this before. But if we could take a moment to step back from a higher perspective, viewing you driving and taking a different exit, as the observer, it looks like a movie and that scene just changed. It was like, cut to. Have you ever realized that Dreams are in cuts, like a movie. When someone is explaining their dream, they're like, okay, so, yo, I was running in the hallway, and then I went here, and then this monster came out of nowhere, and, the, yo, those are cuts. Those are cuts. You're hopping from one spot to the next. First of all, I just want to apologize. I haven't been staying true to my word. I made the promise of doing a video every single day for every project that I release out into the world. And I've been caught up in madness and in my head and life and the changes, the waves. I don't want to make any excuses, but it's been a journey, but I am so fucking grateful right now. I look at Alchemist and Alchemist by Avery Crane on YouTube. I look at this and I compare it to Creator. That's the one that came before. And I notice that it's increasing as far as plays go. It's not as big as I want it. You know, nobody, we look at superstars and we see that they got a million views and then we compare it to ours. You know, that's what we do. It's natural. But I notice, slowly but surely, it's moving up in a positive direction. So I'm grateful for that. For anybody who has listened to it and actually taken their fucking time to listen to it, fucking thank you. Holy shit, you are divine. And all you had to do was pay attention. And so, um, oh, Magi comes out. Ooh, I know, that comes out uh, April Fool's Day, Easter Day, or does it? So check this out. And then after that, we're going to do full because, you know, we all got to be a fool sometimes. Oh, well, that's it. You only get a glimpse. I'm not done with it, but yeah, so peace, blessings, go listen to Alchemist. Go listen to Creator and stay tuned for Magi.